The Top 10 Best Things to Do in Tanzania, East Africa. Number 10. Tarangir National Park. Nestled in the heart of Tanzania, Tarangir National Park is a sanctuary where nature's rhythm beats in harmony with the vast landscape. As you enter this realm, the iconic baobab trees stand like sentinels, their ancient trunks bearing witness to the passage of time. The park's lifeblood, the Tarangira River, meanders through the terrain, a magnet for wildlife seeking respite from the heat. The air vibrates with the trumpeting of elephants, the largest herds in the country, which roam freely among the acacia and the grasslands. Their majestic presence is a reminder of the untamed spirit that defines this land. The park's diverse habitats support an impressive array of fauna. Giraffes stretch towards the sky, zebras stripe the golden savanna, and lions bask under the shade, their gazes piercing through the tranquility. Birdsong fills the air, a testament to the over 550 avian species that decorate the skies and woodlands. From the vibrant lilac-breasted roller to the stealthy martial eagle, each bird adds a splash of color and character to the park's canvas. As the day wanes, the sky transforms into a kaleidoscope of oranges and purples, the sun setting behind the rugged horizon. Nightfall brings a symphony of sounds, from the laugh of the hyena to the whispering of the nocturnal creatures, each playing their part in the park's nocturne. Tarangire is not just a destination. It's an experience that captivates the soul, a place where memories are etched against a backdrop of beauty and wonder. It's a journey through an untamed paradise, a treasure trove of nature's finest offerings. Nine, the Maasai culture. Immersing oneself in Maasai culture is to step into a world where traditions are as vibrant as the red shukas worn with pride. The Maasai, a semi-nomadic people of East Africa, have preserved their way of life amidst the savannas and hills, living in harmony with the land and their livestock. The air resonates with the rhythmic chants and leaps of the Adumu, the so-called jumping dance, a testament to the strength and agility of Maasai warriors. These Morans, young men trained in the arts of survival and protection, embody the community's values of courage and resilience. In the heart of their villages, or maniatas, life unfolds in circular huts built from mud, sticks, grass, and cow dung. Here, families gather, stories are passed down, and the bonds of kinship are strengthened. The Maasai's intricate beadwork, not just decorative but also rich in symbolism, adorns both people and objects, signifying social status and milestones reached. Cattle are central to Maasai life, providing sustenance and serving as a measure of wealth. The pastoralists move with the seasons, guided by a deep understanding of the ecosystems they inhabit. This intimate connection with nature is evident in their sustainable practices and respect for the wildlife that shares their home. To engage with Maasai culture is to gain insight into a community where ancient customs meet the challenges of the modern world. It is an encounter with a people whose spirit, hospitality, and enduring customs leave a lasting impression on all who visit their lands. 8. Scuba diving off Menemba Island. Submerging into the waters off Menemba Island is like entering a different realm where the bustle of daily life fades into the tranquil lull of the ocean. The island, a secluded gem off the coast of Zanzibar is encircled by an atoll that cradles one of the most breathtaking underwater ecosystems in the world. As divers descend, they are greeted by the vibrant tapestry of coral gardens, a kaleidoscope of colors and shapes that form the backdrop for an array of marine life. The clear, turquoise waters boast visibility that often extends up to 30 meters, making every dive an intimate encounter with this aquatic wonderland. The coral reefs serve as a sanctuary for over 400 species of fish, their hues as varied as the corals they swim amongst. Schools of playful dolphins are a common sight, their graceful movements a dance that invites onlookers to marvel at their freedom. Turtles glide by with a serene composure, while the occasional whale shark offers a rare and thrilling spectacle. Each dive is a narrative of discovery, from the shallow coral gardens to the deeper walls and wrecks that tell stories of the past. The Mnemba Atoll is not just a diving location. It's a living, breathing gallery of the ocean's treasures, a place where nature's artistry is on full display. For those who seek communion with the sea, Mnemba Island is more than a dive. It's a journey into the heart of the ocean, a serene escape that remains etched in the memory long after the last bubble rises to the surface. 
Number 7. The House of Wonders The House of Wonders, standing majestically in the heart of Stonetown, Zanzibar, is a beacon of cultural and historical significance. This grand edifice, also known as Beit al-Ajayib, was once a sultan's palace and later became a symbol of progress as the first building in East Africa to be adorned with electricity and an elevator. Upon approaching the House of Wonders, one is immediately struck by its imposing architecture, a blend of local and colonial influences, with its wide verandas supported by cast iron columns. The main entrance, famously wide enough to allow an elephant to pass, invites visitors into a world where the past and present converge. Inside, the large central courtyard is surrounded by galleries that tell the tales of Zanzibar's rich history. Exhibits showcase the island's cultural fusion, displaying artifacts from the Sultanate era, traditional Swahili garments, and remnants of the island's trade heritage. Each room whispers stories of the bygone era, from the Sultan's reign to the British protectorate and the short-lived but historic Anglo-Zanzibar War. The House of Wonders is not merely a museum. It is a journey through time. The carved wooden doors inscribed with verses from the Quran lead to rooms with marble floors and silver decorations, echoing the opulence that once filled these halls. The palace's history is palpable, with each artifact and architectural detail offering a glimpse into the island's storied past. As one leaves the House of Wonders, the experience lingers, a testament to the enduring legacy of Zanzibar's cultural tapestry. Six, the beaches of Zanzibar. The beaches of Zanzibar are a symphony of nature's finest elements, harmonizing to create a serene escape for any visitor. Imagine stepping onto the soft, powdery sands that stretch for miles, each grain glistening under the warm embrace of the sun. The gentle rustle of palm leaves sways in the coastal breeze, providing a soothing soundtrack to a day spent by the sea. The Indian Ocean laps at the shores with its clear turquoise waters, inviting swimmers to bask in its refreshing caress. The tides, a rhythmic dance of the sea, reveal hidden treasures in the form of tidal pools teeming with marine life, waiting to be explored during periods of retreat. Each beach on this enchanting island offers a unique experience. From the lively shores of the north, where the ocean remains within reach throughout the day, to the tranquil coves of the east, where the waters are a haven for divers and surfers alike. The west coast boasts calmer waters, ideal for those seeking a peaceful retreat, while the east presents dramatic tidal changes, a spectacle in itself. As the day unfolds, the beaches become a canvas for a myriad of activities. The air fills with the thrill of kite surfing, the laughter of families playing, and the chatter of friends lounging under thatched umbrellas at beachside bars. As the sun sets, the sky turns into a blaze of colors, casting a golden hue over the tranquil waters. Zanzibar's beaches are not just a destination. They are an experience that captivates the senses, a place where memories are made and the soul finds tranquility. Number five, Gorongoro Crater. Gorongoro Crater, a breathtaking natural wonder nestled in the eastern Great Rift Valley of northern Tanzania, is a place of unparalleled beauty and majesty. This vast, unbroken caldera, formed about 2.5 million years ago, is a sanctuary for an incredible diversity of wildlife and a testament to the Earth's geological power. The journey to the crater's rim reveals a panorama that stretches across 102 square miles, or 264 square kilometers, where the grassland floor teems with life. The descent into the crater is a passage into a world where time seems to stand still and nature reigns supreme. Elephants roam beneath the heavily forested rim, black rhinoceroses graze quietly, and lions rest in the shade after a hunt, their golden eyes watching over their domain. Lake Magadi, a shallow soda lake at the crater's base, shimmers under the African sun, attracting flocks of pink flamingos that paint the waters with a splash of color. The local Maasai people, with their cattle, coexist within this landscape, continuing their age-old traditions and adding a rich cultural dimension to the natural splendor. The Ngorongoro Crater is not just a destination for wildlife enthusiasts. It's a place where one can witness the circle of life in its most raw and vibrant form. It's an experience that connects visitors with the primal forces of nature and the delicate balance that sustains it, whether gazing upon the grazing herds, spotting a leopard in the brush, or simply breathing in the pure air at the top of the world, 
the crater leaves an indelible mark on the soul, a reminder of the wonders our planet holds. Number four, balloon ride over the Serengeti. Ascending into the skies as dawn breaks over the Serengeti, one is lifted into a realm of peace and splendor. The ground falls away, and the vastness of the savanna stretches to the horizon, bathed in the soft glow of the morning sun. The hot air balloon rises gracefully, guided by the gentle winds, offering a bird's eye view of the wilderness below. From this vantage point, the Serengeti reveals its secrets. Herds of wildebeest moving like rivers of life across the plains, elephants wandering amidst the acacia trees, and giraffes browsing the treetops. The balloon floats over this tapestry of life, silent except for the occasional burst of flame that propels it higher. The flight is a serene experience where the only sounds are the whispers of the wind and the distant calls of wildlife. The pilot navigates the balloon over the Serengeti's diverse landscapes, from the golden grasslands to the scattered woodlands and meandering rivers. Each moment in the air is a discovery, a chance to see the world from a perspective few have the privilege to witness. As the journey continues, the sun climbs higher, casting a warm light over the land. The flight concludes with a gentle touchdown and a celebratory breakfast in the midst of the Serengeti's beauty. It's an experience that transcends the ordinary, a memory to cherish for a lifetime. Number three, diving and snorkeling in Zanzibar. Diving and snorkeling in Zanzibar transport you to an underwater spectacle that rivals the most vivid dreams. The warm Indian Ocean waters, with temperatures hovering around 80.6 degrees Fahrenheit or 27 degrees Celsius, embrace you as you descend into a world where time seems to stand still. Visibility often extends beyond 30 meters, unveiling an aquatic playground teeming with life. The coral reefs of Zanzibar, flourishing with over 500 species of marine inhabitants, create a mosaic of color and movement. Mnemba Atoll, a renowned conservation area, offers a sanctuary where turtles and dolphins are common companions. And from September to December, the majestic whale sharks grace these waters with their presence. For those seeking adventure, the strong currents of Levin Bank challenge even the most experienced, rewarding their efforts with sightings of kingfish, trevally, and tuna. Meanwhile, sites like Nankavel and Hunga Reef provide a gentler introduction to the underwater world, with their shallower depths still promising encounters with reef sharks and barracudas. Above all, Zanzibar's diving and snorkeling experiences are defined by their accessibility to all. Whether you're gazing at the intricate patterns of a honeycomb moray eel, following the graceful arc of a manta ray, or simply floating above a garden of corals, each moment is a discovery, a chance to connect with the ocean's wonders in a way that leaves a lasting imprint on the heart. Two, climbing Mount Kilimanjaro. Climbing Mount Kilimanjaro is an endeavor that calls to those seeking to stand atop the highest peak in Africa. It's a journey that begins in the lush rainforests at the mountain's base, where the air is thick with moisture and the calls of exotic birds. As you ascend, the landscape transforms, passing through a tapestry of climates and terrains, from the dense forest to the heath and moorlands, and finally to the alpine desert. The path winds upwards, challenging your body and spirit, but the camaraderie among climbers fosters a sense of unity and shared purpose. Nights are spent under canvas, with the sky a glittering canopy of stars, untouched by city lights. Each day brings new vistas, the sun rising over Moenzi Peak, the surreal beauty of the Barranco Wall, and the ethereal silence of the summit glaciers. Reaching the summit, Uhuru Peak, is a moment of triumph, a culmination of determination and endurance. Standing at 19,341 feet, the roof of Africa offers views that are vast and boundless. The horizon stretches to eternity, and for a moment it feels as if you are suspended between the heavens and the earth. The descent is a time of reflection, with the mountain's grandeur etched into memory. Kilimanjaro is more than a mountain. It's a testament to the human spirit's quest for adventure and the profound beauty of the natural world. Climbing it is not just a physical feat, but a transformative experience that lingers long after the journey home. One, explore Serengeti National Park. Embarking on a journey through Serengeti National Park is to wander into the heart of the wild, 
where the land stretches into infinity and the rhythm of nature pulses around you. This vast expanse of savanna, home to the iconic Great Migration, is a theater of life where each day brings a new performance of survival and beauty. As you traverse the open plains, the grasses whisper tales of the countless hooves that have passed before. The Serengeti is a sanctuary for the majestic, from the stately elephants to the elusive leopards. Each turn of the path offers a chance to witness the raw power of lions or the graceful dance of a giraffe against the backdrop of an acacia-studded horizon. The park skies are just as alive, with birds of prey soaring high and colorful songbirds flitting among the trees. The air is filled with the sounds of the wild, the roar of a distant lion, the cackle of hyenas, and the constant hum of the smaller creatures that call this place home. As the sun sets, painting the sky in hues of orange and purple, the land transforms. The night chorus begins and the stars emerge, turning the sky into a canvas of celestial wonder. To explore the Serengeti, is to connect with the primal essence of the planet, a reminder of the enduring splendor of the natural world. It's an adventure that transcends the ordinary, leaving a trail of awe and respect in the heart of every beholder. Tanzania beckons with its unparalleled natural beauty, from the majestic Serengeti to the mystical summit of Kilimanjaro, offering a world of adventure and serenity. It's a land where every horizon promises discovery and every moment is steeped in the rich tapestry of life, inviting all to witness its wonders. Hi, I'm Rachel. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed or learned anything about what you've just seen, then please like us and hit that subscribe button. We're just getting started, so you'd be doing us a huge favor it really helps out a small channel like this one. I hope we earned your subscription today, but if we didn't, I promise we'll keep making great videos until we do. Join us next time when we'll take another wonderful trip in the Travelarium.